I'm David King. I work for Scott's Primary, and uh, we're going to be here at Hopewell Church. We're going to apply a water-resistant barrier to these exterior walls that we done framed around this red iron building. But uh, the codes are the same on all these exterior walls. I mean, you got to have a, a barrier, a water-resistant barrier. Uh, a lot of people call it Tyvek, whatever, house route. Uh, two inches at the horizontal level. In other words, you got to lap two inches like that. All right, and then they get six inches the other way. So, horizontal way, they got to lap six inches. So, you know, it's pretty simple. Uh, it's up to you whether you want to fix it or not. It ain't, it ain't really that bad. I mean, it make more of a mess trying to, you know, put all them little holes in it now. Yeah, but it, I don't think it's worth it to you. Two, back up. Three. Yeah. I wouldn't think so. We'll just tear the tie back up, right? Whatever you think, man. All right, now what we did, we went all the way around this building with the four rows. Now, what we got left for these gables, we saw the rows in half, like this, with a skill saw. It's just that easy. You cut that off. No. Huh? No. Oh, yeah, though, in the gable, yeah. You don't go up? You see, they're not up that high, they're like 14 feet off the ground, but we got the luxury of working off a SkyTrack platform. So, you know, if you don't have that, you got to work off a ladder. It's a lot more difficult, more dangerous. Just be careful when you're installing this stuff. 